Dr. Derek Grusfeld from the Children's Memorial Hospital, Warsaw, explains the background to the study that is looking at whether different protein content in formula milk or breastfeeding in babies results in differing mental performance in school-aged children. What was the main idea behind your study? We are involved in Work Package 4, which is the uh, continuation of follow-up of the cohort of children uh, that were randomized uh, to the European Childhood Obesity Study. Uh, it was uh, started in 2002. We randomized uh, about uh, 1,500 children in five different uh, European uh, centers in five countries, Western and Central Europe. Uh, and uh, the main idea at the beginning was to check if uh, the uh, in nutritional intervention uh, such as um, feeding babies uh, at the early stage of their life with different protein intake, different protein content uh, in their formula has any influence on the risk of uh, obesity or overweight uh, in later life. And uh, this uh, idea was uh, uh, confirmed uh, uh, by the study at the age of uh, when the children were at the age of two years. Now uh, our cohort uh, consists of the same babies which are at school age. They are eight years old now. And uh, the main focus of uh, our uh, the main focus of our research now on the same cohort is to check if our nutritional intervention in the first year of life has any influence on their uh, neurodevelopment now. We have also, uh, except uh, two, arms, uh, of, uh, in two arms of children um, who are formula fed, we also have a control group uh, of children that were breastfed. So we can compare uh, the formula fed children with breastfed children. We hope that we, we, uh, that we could compare them now. How does it fit in with Nutrimenthe? It fits very well, I think, because uh, the idea of Nutrimenthe is uh, to assess the influence of nutrition on uh, neurodevelopmental outcome of children. And uh, I think we are doing just this. Our cohort had a nutritional intervention and we are assessing their neurodevelopment now. Uh, we are also checking uh, the level of some specific uh, micronutrients, macronutrients and vitamins in, uh, in their blood at the age of eight years, and it was checked also at the age of five and a half. And uh, we will also check the correlation between the level of specific micronutrients uh, with their uh, neurological outcome. We hope also that our intervention, uh, we are sure, but we would like to prove also that our intervention had no uh, uh, no negative effect also on the neuro neurodevelopment, which is for some people maybe a very um, important question. What are the results so far? The neurological assessment of these children is uh, starting just now, in October 2010. So it's a bad news that we cannot uh, present uh, any results about that at this moment. Um, because the randomization lasted for one and a half year, so the whole group will be, uh, will be assessed for this time, for one and a half year, and we expect results after this time.